Oracle's procure to pay process is an integrated solution that links purchasing and payables module to maximize a return on invested capital, which eventually integrates to subledger accounting and general ledger for accounting the transactions finally. With Oracle procure to pay organization can reduce cost to improve margin, streamline procure to pay processes to improve working capital and drive compliance to op optimize asset usage. The most obvious benefit is that a procure to pay process can bring light to inefficiencies and gives businesses the ability to proactively manage suppliers for organizations this means employees can easily and quickly buy all the goods and services need from preferred contracts ensures they stay within budget and work with required approvals manual labor involving fixing invoicing issues caused by suppliers missing orders and receipts are more easily resolved the ptp cycle can offer an organization a complete platform with procurement of goods and services raw material components office supplies etc when there is a purchase made from a vendor or a supplier there should be a payment made associated to that purchase so to summarize the entire process of purchasing goods and services and making payment for that purchase of goods and services to the supplier or vendor is called a procure to pay process so we would create a requisition in i procurement module or create it in a purchasing module and then we would create a purchase order we can either create it by um, a manual purchase order or we can automatically create it through a requisition which is called auto create and uh, once we have the purchase order we once we receive goods we have to receive the goods in our system uh, so we would create a receipt of that particular goods and uh, then once we get the invoice from the vendor we have to enter the invoice entering invoices there are two different methods one is where you can enter it manually or you can match it to a PO purchase order and then we need to make a payment for those purchases uh, and we can do it either quick pay or we can do it through a payment batch and finally once all the transactions are complete and then we need to create accounting and transfer those accounting to Oracle General Ledger. This is the complete overview of a procure to pay process. Uh, we will see each of the processes in more detailed manner with some live examples how we perform transactions in Oracle application eBusiness Suite.